Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this animation with using After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and first of all, select this map layer and let's unhide and move the anchor point center like this. And let's press R open rotation and create rotation keyframe change minus 50 and let's go to 10 keyframes for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down in keyboard or let me show other way click time duration and write plus 10 for go to 10 keyframes click ok and change this 25 go to again 10 keyframes change minus 12 again 10 keyframes change 6 Again, 10 keyframes, change minus 3. Again, 10 keyframes, change 1.5. Again, 10 keyframes, change 0. So, there are more keyframes for bounce animation and smooth realistic animation. Select keyframes, make easy or click F9. And preview animation. Okay, that's good. And go to first second, hold shift, press S, open scale, and change scale 0. And create scale keyframe and go to here 10 keyframes change 130 again 10 keyframes change 90 again 10 keyframes change 105 again 10 keyframes change 95 again 10 keyframes change 100 percent and select scale keyframes make easy preview again okay so select scale keyframes Hold Alt and move to right for random animation. Let's say again. Okay, pretty good. And select all two frames. Hold Alt and move to the left. For more fast animation. So in this time, select these pin 2 and pin 1 layers. Let's enable. Let's link to map layer. Also select road line, enable. And link to map layer. So in this time, select pin 1 and pin 2. Let's zoom in here and select pin 2. Let's go to anchor point. Move the anchor point down. Clearization tool and select pin 1. Go to anchor point and move to down also. Clearization tool and go to window. Open animation comes as 3. If you have not animation comes as 3, I will add link on the description below. Select pin 1 and pin 2. Go to starter presets. Let's open to the layers and overshot scale from anchor point. And click in. So let's close window. And let's move to right these layers. And for slow animation, select these marks and move to right for more slow animation. And select pin 2, move to right and let's preview full animation let's timing select pins and move to here let's see okay that's good so in this time select this road lion and go to solo let's see okay and go to pen tool let's add one line here 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 and here and click session tool, select rod lion and delete layer. Select shape layer 1, change rod lion map. And also go to fill, you can click here for turn off inside color. Select none, click ok. And change stroke width and color change yellow. Click ok. And let's go to add and trim path. Open trim path 1 here and change end 0. Go to first second. Let's create in keyframe and go to 3 seconds. Change 100%. And for smooth start and end lines, open stroke 1 here, change bat cup to run cup. Okay, and go to here. Let's click dashes and change dashes like this road line like this okay and for animate this road line 
go to first second and create offset keyframe and go to 10 seconds and change minus 2000 let's see nice and select these start keyframes make easy select last keyframe move to left okay let's close settings select this road line also link to map layer and and let's see okay let's unsolo layer okay very good select this road line move to behind of pin layers and select this pin one let's move to here and pin two let's put here okay select these pins move to left and select this road line move to here okay very nice so in this time select this map layer and let's see timing and press s let's create new scale keyframe and click this icon and go to 10 keyframes chain scale like this okay and select keyframes go to graph editor let's zoom in here select the second keyframe move to the left and let's see okay that's good and back to keyframes select all layers hold ctrl a let's unselect this background and click this checkbox for 3d layers okay very nice and close scale settings so right now we have 3d layers and in this time go to layer new and create new camera don't change any settings click ok and let's select camera one right mouse go to camera and create orbit node for control camera movements again hold control and click pen behind icon for move the anchor point center click section tool so right now select this null object press p and let's see timing let's create new passing keyframe and go to five keyframes and move to down camera like this and select keyframes make easy go to graph editor select this graph make smooth animation let's see okay back to keyframes and right now select this hand layer and phone layer text city and fingers let's enable layers okay and go to here let's move to down these hand layers okay and move to center let's enable title action save move to center like this okay let's see nice and select this map layer press u for see active keyframes select scale keyframes move to left okay let's move to left more and let's hold shape press p and create new passing keyframe go to here and move it down like this okay so select these keyframes and make easy let's see okay go to graph editor select this graph let's make graph smooth okay so so select this map keyframe last keyframe move to the left okay and right now select this city layer and let's link to map layer and move to up to map layer okay and move the anchor point down click session tool let's see okay so in this time let's select this map layer and hold shift press t and create opacity keyframe go to here change zero and select these pin layers pin one pin two and road lion and press s and create scale keyframes go to here change zero select this city layer and press s open scale and click this icon and let's see okay in this time let's create new scale keyframe and go to three keyframes 
for go to frame by frame keyframes use paste down keyboard one two three and let's change scale 60 again go to three keyframes one two three change 110 again go to three keyframes one two three change 90 again three keyframes change 100 make your frames easy let's see okay select three keyframes hold alt move right also select this map layer enable motion blur okay so in this time select this hand layer and move the anchor point down and move the down a little bit like this okay and select this phone layer link to hand layers and select text link to phone layer and fingers link to hand layer and select finger let's go to solo select anchor point and move to here calculation tool and unsolo and select hand layer let's see timing okay in this time let's press r and create z rotation let's go to 10 frame change minus 10 and go to back and right now select city go to edit and split layer and select city 2 let's link to phone layer okay and go to here go to 10 frames again change 5 again 10 frame change minus 2.5 again 10 frame change 0 and select two frames make easy and let's hold alt move to left let's see okay let's move to left okay that's good and select this finger layer press r create new z rotation and go to here let's change like this and next few frame change again and next few frame change minus two and let's few frame change zero select few frames make easy and for random animation hold alt move to right nice and and select this text layer let's move the anchor point down let's go to here and let's move the anchor point down like this clicization tool and press s click this icon and create new scale two frame move to right and change scale zero make two frames easy and move to left Go to graph editor and make graph like this. So in this time, let's go to window, animation comes as three, starter precoms, shape elements, and let's select shape elements. Let's use particle fireworks. Click add and, and move to up. Okay, we can use right now and let's use color fill change color white and press s change scale and in this time select this null object and let's create new Python Q frame go to here and move to left And select these layer 3, road and road lion, wheels and car. Let's enable and move to here. Let's see. Okay, not bad. And select this car layer. Let's move the anchor point down. Clicization tool. And let's press R and create new Z rotation Q frame. Change minus four, and go to ten Q frames. Change four again. Ten Q frames. Let's change minus four. Select Q frames. Make easy. And select work area. Okay, and let's hold Control. Click time icon for add expression. 
Go to play button, prepare to end loopout duration. For done expiration, click this empty area. Let's see. Okay, so select these three keyframes. Let's move to left for loop animation. Okay, and let's move to down this little bit. Nice, and select this car. Let's hold shift press P and create new passing keyframe. Go to 10 keyframes. Move to down, again 10 Q frames, select first Q frame, copy pass, and make Q frames easy. And move to the left, again hold Alt, click time icon, go to play button, prepare to end loopout duration. Let's see. Okay, so in this time, change rotations minus 1, and this 2, and again last Q frame minus 1. And select rotation two frames hold alt move to right okay that's good so in this time go to pen tool and let's create line like this click session tool change stroke let's open inside contents shape one stroke one and click these dashes change dashes size like this and color let's use black Click OK and offset. Let's select full composition and go to first second. And let's create offset keyframe and let's keyframe change to thousand. Okay, and let's click solid layer. Okay, select shape layer, press U and go to last second, change minus two thousand. And let's change this minus five thousand or minus 9000 okay so select shape layer change name line rod and move the behind of wheels and let's move the up okay and select this road line let's delete and move the up more and let's back to animation comes to 3 and let's use background lines click add okay right now we can use this and press r chain rotation minus 90 and use fill color white okay not bad let's see again so also we can use this line for this scene, select lines, control D for duplicate, go to here and press R, change zero. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.